I would like to know what you think about bottle feeding. Okay, tell me the one you prefer. Do you prefer breastfeeding directly or do you prefer expressing or do you prefer formulas? I would like to know your thoughts here. And back to my channel it's another video in case if you're seeing this face for the first time my name is Uju welcome to Ujulin space okay please consider subscribing to my channel it is totally free I would like to have you here I would like to have you here okay please subscribe to my channel and I'll appreciate it a whole lot okay to my wonderful subscribers thank you so much for your massive love and support I truly 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 appreciate okay so let's just get right into this video but before we proceed I would like to know where are you watching me from drop it in the comment section for me what videos do you enjoy more what do you want to see more some people are like would you be a pretty lady can you show yourself more I'm like hold on hold on <laughs> beautiful mm, I know I'm beautiful pretty am I <laughs> Can you tell me the difference between being beautiful and being pretty? Like, I don't know. I know I'm a beautiful lady. Right? I am. But am I pretty? <laughs> don't mind me. Let's just get right into this video. Okay, so today I'll be talking to you about the importance or rather the advantages and disadvantages of bottle feeding okay and like you we all know bottle feeding can it can actually mean you know you expressing your breast milk in a bottle or you mixing formula in a bottle whichever way or even mixing some people mix pap like solids in bottle and feed their babies whichever way they are all bottle feeding and of course we all know that um what's it called when you extract express sorry when you express your breast milk in a bottle the baby gets just exact the exact nutrients it's just same way with you know when your baby latches or sucks directly from your breast that's still the same nutrient but then when you express okay and then decide to store in the fridge of course a lot of things might reduce okay it will never be as fresh or rather as um hundred percent there is still everything is still intact okay but it won't be the same like freezing will reduce a bit of the nutritive value okay but it's still okay okay it's still okay all right so for me let's just talk about the advantages first then we'll move over to the advantages if this is the type of videos you like please watch to the end and don't forget to give me thumbs up if you like it subscribe to my channel if you've not I noticed that a lot of people that are not subscribed to my channel watches me more than people that are subscribed please click on that subscribe button to join this my family this is my family you will enjoy it here you will enjoy it here <laughs> all right guys so i'll be talking about the advantages of bottle feeding okay the first one is it is flexible like a lot of people can feed your baby if you're not around be it your uncle be it your aunt be it your husband be it your you know older siblings anybody can feed your child so it is flexible you know you can just mix up something or express and just give or yeah, feed baby and that's it you see yeah that is number one the number two is you can see and measure the quantities of food your baby takes okay when your baby sucks directly you might not know the quantity because just like we know children eat differently okay some people are slow eaters some are very fast eaters so when you bottle feed you will know okay if it is 120 meals that you expressed or you mixed if you're using baby formulas you will know that your child was able to finish this quantity of milk okay so this is the number two uh, what's it called number two um advantages of bottle feeding okay let's move over to the next one the next one is babies that eat formulas they don't eat as frequent as babies that that suck directly because just it's still the same thing with my number two um advantage because when you know you be able to measure or you're able to know the quantity of, of food your child is taking when you express or once you are you are what's it called feeding your child with bottle the child doesn't eat as frequent as children that you know takes that latches directly from the breast okay another point is it, it improves bonding time just like I said before family members can have time to bond with your child it's because when you are you know feeding directly 
with you no know, through your breasts or something if you're not bottle feeding it's just you okay you enjoy that bond alone but when you are bottle feeding your child can bond properly with your family members okay this is these are the advantages let's move over to the disadvantages formulas they don't provide the same nutrients with breast milk except if you are giving breast milk or well, most people that bottle feed usually they bottle they give formulas okay formulas don't give and you know formulas don't fight diseases bacteria, infections viruses the same way breast milk does so the next point is you have to be very careful while mixing your formula you have to know the exact quantity of water to dilute the milk weight okay so that is another point if you are not careful hmm, that child might suffer from constipation and of course you know and um, the food might not be given to your child in the right condi not condition in the right temperature okay yeah unlike you know when you are giving your child directly the temperature everything is on point that's one of our disadvantages of bottle feeding okay another point is it is expensive guys the bottles, the formula, the nipples, the breast pump, I mean the rubber nipple though, not your... <laughs> the breast pump can be expensive guys, like it can be expensive, so bottle feeding is expensive. Another point is formulas can cause indigestive problems, okay, what I mean, I've said it before, you know, when you don't mix those things properly, it can lead to constipation and gas, okay. These are another disadvantages of bottle feeding, yeah. Bottle feeding with formula though. If you are giving powdered formula, is the water clean enough? There's another point of um, what is it called to be considered while bottle feeding, and this can actually be a disadvantage as well. So, you know, and of course, when you give your child something that is not okay, what will happen to the child? The child might end up in the hospital. So, this brings me to the end of this video. What are your thoughts? Drop it in the comment section for me. I would like to know what you think about bottle feeding. Okay, tell me the one you prefer. Do you prefer breastfeeding directly or do you prefer expressing or do you prefer formulas i would like to know your thoughts here and whatever thing you think is still beautiful okay i would like to know i'm gonna reply to each and every one of you all right thank you so much if you watch up until now please subscribe i can never stop saying subscribe I can never say stop saying subscribe. Please subscribe to my channel, do your notification bell, okay? And then share my videos, like, comment. I will see you guys soon in my next video. Bye, guys. Mwah.